guys welcome back to a brand new disney heroes battle mode video and as you all know guys i always like to go through the comments of my previous video and feature someone on the wall to win um this month's giveaway which is going to be done on a live stream at the start of next month so let's see today we've had a lot of people obviously someone's on chapter 35 which is good quite a few people saying rocketeer um isn't going to be that great we've got someone saying rocketeer is insane donovan wants me to upgrade animal i do actually need to work on animal because being honest he will work very very well with a lot of my characters animal so i will do that and then we've got nice dude Telephony is the best. So I think David's gonna gonna go up onto the wall. Just for that lovely, lovely comment. It was a nice comment that I saw last night, just before I went off to sleep. So it was very, very nice for him to leave a comment like that. And um yeah. Thank you, David. David Cruz, you're gonna go up on the wall into the live stream event that me and Ethan will be hosting. So good luck there. Okay, so let's get straight into today's video. And for today's video, guys, I wanted to focus um, a little bit on more friendship missions with Kermit. Now, I've obviously... Don't worry, I didn't forget that these friendship missions existed. I have still been kind of farting around with them. But I just never really got to the stage where um, I kind of went, yeah, that, that's it, I'm happy now. Let's move on. I just kind of forgot. But I have still been constantly collecting the... Um, the little bits for them so what what i mean by that is i've been constantly going through and getting the those little power boosters so if i go into the friendship missions now let's just claim that first we've also got the new invasion mode open up as well now which is oh the team where kerma gets the buff which is awesome but that's that's not for today right so if we go into kermit now um they still got the weird glitchy stars now as well they never i thought that might have been a glitch but maybe not so I want to upgrade max health with Kermit once, like that, because what I really want to do after it's been advanced once is upgrade it so he's got a starting shield, just so he can take a couple more dings, um, kind of like I've done with Winnie the Pooh, so Winnie the Pooh stays alive and really, really can get the heals in, so that's what I'm going to do there, obviously I need to advance it and I don't want to waste Kermit shards yet, but that's third in line, I'm going to get Kermit to six stars, I'm going to get his red skill, then I'm going to start to upgrade all of his mods, which is quite nice, it's going to be quite, you know, like I said, always slow, 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 painful, but we'll get there. So now, before I jump into that, let's go on to Gonzo and see if I can upgrade Gonzo. I actually really like Gonzo. I didn't realise how much of a good character he was. Obviously, I've been working on him a lot recently just for the fact of... Um, uh, okay, let's, let's get his big one. There we go. That'll give me loads of XP as well. Yes. Lovely. Leveled up again. Equip that onto him there. I don't think I'm going to have enough to do any of these. But, you know, for now, that's a nice little push-up, guys for me to work on there lovely loads of xp that's why i recommend you don't really buy the xp anymore it, it's just not really that necessary and i've upgraded some of the mods in there and yeah okay so let's go straight away now and get into these friendship missions so what i can do is increase kermit to 261 and max out all of his skills great and now let's go and see how many we can do so um, oh no, I'm sorry, I've clicked the wrong one there. I don't want to be doing his one with Duck and Bunny. It is that on there, 32 boost. Okay, these guys should be ridiculous. Oh my goodness, 6.93 million. I should, come on. I was going to say, if, if, I, if I couldn't quick fight these... Uh, ridiculous okay oh no i don't mean to okay let's let's fight let's get to the last one guys and then we'll fight the last one yeah here and we're gonna get his disc here come on this is the moment this is the moment this is the moment okay Oof. 370 000. just for you guys um who don't know or haven't realized that you can do missions to power them up to make them better in friendship missions and that's kind of what i've been doing here there you go everyone's down there Yes, the, the, it's just like the animals. We've got the chicken and the frog are just destroying through everything. There we go. Oh, that's Winnie the Pooh as well. There we go. That is a huge moment, guys. We have both of them unlocked, equipped, and then, look at that, <coughs> 185. 185 there, guys. That's mad. 
So obviously guys, I was looking between both of their discs, right? And I just wanted to compare their discs here. So this one here is fantastic. Tank heroes on team game reality, tank heroes on team game armor, basic damage per ally whose role is a tank. So basically the more tanks you have, the more basic damage um, everybody's going to do. And what I like more is here, buffs from rainbow connection last so basically you're about to get that up to a relative because I don't know how I've got that many for him, but you're going to be able to get that up to a good stage. Then it says, um, Rainbow Connection adds 30% more armor ratchet to tank rolls. So it's just armor and that's going to go up and that's going to go up. So the Rainbow Connection is going to last longer, which is going to give everyone, you know, the invincibility, the attack buffs, depending on the buff it's going to mimic. And then we're going to have 30% more on tanks, which is madness. So obviously you need to take into consideration now that it's important to pair Kermit with a tank. And the reason I'm focusing on this is because I like to use Kermit and Maximus. It's going to make them absolutely fantastic now. So let's go. I, I can probably imagine that what I will need to do is make sure that I work on upgrading. Um, um, their, I need to obviously level. Oh my goodness. I failed on 7 million power. All right. Let's see how that happened. Let's see. Okay, select a target. Oh, that's for Manticore, isn't it? Let's take that, do that guy. Ah, that's probably why it failed. The auto probably glitched that out. So as long as, uh, let's do Randall. Oh, I just killed him one instantly. No. Yes, we got the invincibility on. 1.8 million damage that does buffed. Here we go. Roll through. Smash that on. Everyone's invincible. We got the invincibility again. Come on. Come on. Come on. They shouldn't be able to take Kermit out on his own here. We got the shield on him. Big damage again there. Come on, Kermit. Shield. There we go. I love the way it duplicates the shield as well. Come on, even with these boosters. Come on. Gonzo, what are you playing at here? Come on, Gonzo. Come on, get the damage in. Oh. Now, why is Rex healing? Come on. Ah. Oh. Okay, that means I am going to have to get Manticore leveled up a little bit. Let's go. I should be able to get Manticore to six stars, you know. There we go. So I've got Manticore to six stars straight away. And let's level her up a, a, just, just a little bit. So she's not an absolute potato. Um, uh, I need this one here. 18 to power craft. Okay, cool. So th this is kind of why I like doing friendship missions as well, guys. Because it does give you the opportunity to sort of slowly level up characters as well. Um, here we go. So let's just, just see what, what we can get here. Let's just keep pushing through here. Um... Okay, so we've, we've only managed to get the blue too. That's useless. And we can get all our skills to 30 there. And um, I could probably um, spam through and get one of her disc here just to make her a little bit more powerful as well. Um, let's have a look. Because I should be able to raid through, I think, with Maximus here. And obviously, this is always going to just give me that extra bit of um, buff for Manticore, which is obviously the most important thing to do. Here we go, come on, let's see if we can get to Manticore's disc. Not that I'm going to upgrade it, but it, it, it's just a little bit of a buff. And that's kind of what I need to keep working on. Just little buffs, little buffs, little buffs, little buffs each time we go. So let's see if I can do this. Let's see what we, we get here. Oh, Manticore managed to stay alive somehow there. I, I get I bet at the, at the end we're going to verse Hades or something. The sound effects of Davy Jones. Oh, yes, we... Okay, we killed his box straight away. Lovely. So, I'm going to take it off for a sec. Let's just see what's going to happen here. I haven't got a particularly... Ah, uh, is, is the... Okay, good. Eat hill. Yes, there we go. Okay, so I just swapped it to manual. I was able to get through that. Lovely. Good. Claim that on. And we can just put that on her like that. When Crusher removes a curse, not particularly great, but um, 
Let's just level it up 400,000. Just give it a little bit more armor there. Just going to tease her to be not hugely fantastic, but just making her a little bit... Um, a little bit better there, guys. There we go. Put level 100 as well. So now let's see. Because what I might be able to do now is get the raid in. Because that should um, increase the overall power level. So let's try and um, quick fight again here. Oh, no. Didn't mean to do that one. Ducking Bunny just flew out of nowhere there. There we go. Um, yeah, okay. Not yet. But let's let's try again here. So obviously, if I fail this one, guys, what, what we'll need to do is take a big focus on... Um, so we've obviously got a few more of our moves now. We've got a fire move. So I'll need to put a more more of a focus on getting Gonzo. Just keep leveling Gonzo up. Because what I should do now is aim to get Gonzo up to um, red 14. And we're really going to be able to see. Because obviously the problem is I need to get... Um, I need to get them to be able to get through. Because when they're on this stage... Oh no, if I'd used that special quicker, Rex probably would have died. Okay, I'm, I'm going to try that again. I'm just going to leave on auto this time. Let's, l let's let it run on auto and see where we can get to. Because I, ha I haven't done an auto um, run through yet. Let's just take a look here. So we've got good hit damage there. Obviously, guys, every day I will be focusing on... Um, I will be focused on just continuing, 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 getting up as much as I can. So roll through. <gasps> oh, Rex dodged it. Rex dodged a special. I probably would have won that again there if Rex hadn't dodged that special. So let's take it off of auto because he just ran out of the screen. Okay, get that on there. But like I said, guys, you know, as as we go, I'm, I'm not going to drop off of their um, missions here until they've done them anyway. Oh, he dodged a special. Okay, so what I should probably do here is... Um, Is save um, Gonzo special. Here we go. Right. So we're, we're gonna we're gonna kill him there. Whatever. He'll he'll die in one hit. Yeah. So we'll go straight in. Right. We're gonna roll through. We're just gonna do damage. We're gonna use that straight away as well. We're just gonna hit. Oh no! Rex just managed to heal again. Come on. Oh, we've taken out... Oh, we've taken out Olaf. We've taken out Olaf. Okay. Okay. Is this the one? Uh, I love how useless Rex is. No, why did he heal? Why did he heal? No. Ah. Uh, okay, so this isn't gonna... I didn't know Rex could heal. Hang on. Is this a, is this his red skill? I've got it. I've got to investigate this. He was so... What? Why? Where is he healing? What's going on here? This is annoying. Rex gains 8 crit damage per buff he has. Time buffs on Rex also don't expire as long as he... Blah, blah, blah. The first time each wave when Rex would be KO'd, he instead cleanses all debuffs on himself and activates... <sighs> Come on. Alright. It looks like we are still going to be waiting a very long time until I can progress any more through Kermit's missions. But I am definitely, definitely not disappointed with today's progress, guys. I didn't realize I, I didn't realize that with Rex's um move. Let's max out his um skills there as well. Okay. So that's got everything maxed out. Obviously, as I go, I'll throw that up and do more of his mods and stuff. So I, I basically just need to keep upgrading this, which I think is uh, will just be his skill power I need to increase here, because we're on 5,000 at the moment. So let's um, let's advance this one once, level it up, see where we get to now, let's see what he's on now. 6,000. So it's just going to be a very, very slow drain up of, of this here, guys. And obviously I've got so many shards spare. Um, 
that this is just going to be this is going to be the way I'm going to do it. This is going to be the beautiful way I'm going to do it. Here we go. Let's just get this stupid chicken move upgraded. And just get the extra damage in. But f for now, for now, that's fine, guys. That's fine. But there we go. So, so that has got Gonzo's stupid chicken move leveled up quite high. Um, support roll enemies lose bait. Uh, both down damage here is a game based house. Gonzo reduces the duration of all attacks and movement speed buffs applied to all enemies. Uh, max HP to Gonzo and allies, skill power, shield. Yeah, so that I was going for that. I think I've got that equipped. Yeah, obviously not on a great level, but okay. So that's kind of um, put me in the right direction, guys. And um, as I play through this week, um, I'm planning on doing a big story mode blitz tomorrow. But as I go through as well, um, I'm going to be upgrading Gonzo. I'm going to try and get Gonzo to red 14 over this week. And then obviously what we'll see there is he'll become even more useful for the story mode and everything. And then what we're also going to see as we go through there is that he's just going to keep increasing, increasing, increasing. Very, very slowly, very slowly. But he's going to keep increasing, 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 just giving me that assist on Kermit's mission. And obviously, guys, as we go through, I'm going to be maxing Kermit out as much as I can as well. But as, as it goes at the moment, his mods aren't hugely exciting. I am going to get health once so I'm just keeping my life a bit longer. But, and then I'll also be slowly work. I'm not hugely fussed about Manticore because at the end of the day, I just want to get Gonzo OP because I actually really like Gonzo. Now, I know, um, yes, yeah, seven more shards for Kermit. Let's go. That is a slow burner, guys. We're getting this. We've got Gonzo maxed out now. I was doing King Louis here because um, he's an absolute don. Uh, Tron's already ready. Kim's not ready yet. And I'm doing loads of claw house in here. But anyway, guys, smash that like and subscribe button. Let me know how far you are on Kermit's missions, guys. I've got a long road to go, but what I will be doing every single day is just continuing, 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 continuing in here, getting those beautiful boosters and power-ups just to assist, like, beyond belief in the guild battles. That's where it lies at the moment. That's where the importance is. Just smashing through, I think. Got some more power there. I was powering someone else, but I cannot remember who it was now. But anyway, yeah, that's what I think is the important bit, guys. And I will see all of you beautiful people in the next one.